Hello loves, welcome back to the Sparkle Z Boutique. Today I am coming to you with my new living room makeover tour. And I changed my living room to a different style altogether. I went from a shabby chic to more of a modern glam look. If you want to see how I did that, you know what you got to do. Keep watching. Shine right like a diamond. Like I said, I had more of a shabby chic look before with a lot of purples, pinks, gold, and more of a very feminine girly look. I really liked the, how it looked, but to me, it was a little overpowering. With the modern glam, it's more simplistic. The colors are more neutral, but you still have your metallics. You still have your glam. So you get the best of both worlds. I would love if you would subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. I'm going to be having a lot of these DIY makeover videos coming to my channel. So that you don't miss any of the fun, make sure you subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to thumbs this video up. Like I said in the intro, I wanted to have more of a modern glam look. And what I first did was took this purple chase and I changed it by painting it gray. I took away the pink and gold accessories and just took and put a gray throw that I threw over here with the gray and white pillow. The pillow came from Lush Decor and I will leave a link to anything that I can find down below. So check the description box. And then I have these two lamps from Offer Up, and I added a one of these decorative boxes and this a rhinestone bookend that I also purchased from Home Goods. And I just keep those extra coasters in that decorative box. And of course, we have these two Pier 1 wall decor hangings. I really like the look of this setup a lot more than what I had before. And another thing that I did is move the bar cart from one end of the room to the other end of the room. And I will leave a link down below how I transformed this bar cart. And I decided to add a side table. And this side table is another DIY. And on the bottom, I have... Another one of those bookends from, from Home Goods paired with that crystal bowl from Burlington Co. Factory. On each side table, I have these two centerpieces from E. Favor Mart, and I will leave the information down below. And on the couch, and of course, I changed out all the pillows from the pink and purple to just a plain, beautiful modern glam silver white and gray different tones different textures i really love the way that it looks and of course we have these curtains from lush decor and these crystal pieces coming from the ceiling to the floor i got from shopwildthings.com it was two separate pieces i cut them in half to make them four and of course i will leave a link down below I have this other side table from Offer Up, and I made sure that I changed the ends of these couches to gold because I just wanted a pop of gold as my pop of color. Okay, I moved this pink leather CT out, and I changed it to the more the I changed it to a gray chair, and instead of the bronze, I decorated with the crystal and gray. And again, with the pop of gold on the candlesticks. And I think it is absolutely gorgeous. These, um, This wall decor that I have is wall decor that I made. And I made them a while ago. But I was wondering if you guys were even interested in seeing how I made them. If you are interested in seeing how I made that, make sure you thumbs this video up. And put down below in the comment section that you want to see how I did that. And again, like I said before, I moved the bar cart from one end to the next. And as you can see, it's transformed now. And I have more, again, of that simplistic, modern look. Well, simplistic for me. And I realized I skipped right on past the coffee table. So I'm going to go back there and show you how I 
changed the accessories, the pink accessory, took away the purple and the pink again, and just added in just the silver, the gold, the gray, and of course, I still have my bling and my glam, and I put a gray throw across the table. If you are not new to my channel, you know that I am covering up a crack on the table. So you can try to make whatever you have in your home work and no one is the wiser. Just to add a little interest to this table, I did take a extra mirror that I had and put it in the bottom of this table with a bowl filled with mirror mosaic Christmas ornaments, but they don't look Christmassy. I just like the way that that looks. I think it gives it a nice little something that you wasn't necessarily expecting and the reflection from it, I just think it turned out so beautifully. And I did get this rug. I got a steal on offer up. Okay, here is an overview of everything that I have done to the living room that Chandelier came from Wayfair.com. If you have any questions about anything that you saw in the video, you want to know where I got it from, just leave it down below. And of course, I would do my best to answer the question. Just in case anybody was wondering, those bronze square mirrors came from Dollar Tree. I love you guys. And as always, be your own kind of beautiful because you, my love, are beautiful. See you next time. Bye.